Hi everyone. I am going to be scrapbooking Brenna um, in her fabulous outfit. I think she's got on a summer shirt, pair of pajamas, and a tutu. Her mom would just say, you know, um, you know, if you want to pick out your clothes, you can or I can do it. And she would always want to do it herself. So I don't know if she's getting ready for bed or if ready for the day. <laughs> And she's got on pajamas and a tutu. So um, I don't know what she's doing here. She's kind of like got her lips perched. I, I don't know if she was saying something or, or what. And then she's grinning in this one. But I just think they're so cute. No particular reason for taking them except for she was the first grand and I'm the grandma. And I took a whole lot of photos. I can't even tell you. They don't fit in the shoe box. Okay, I am using Mente's Berrylicious. And one of these, I think this is um, number two. And then I'm going to be using one of the cut aparts. But um, I've, instead of leaving it as a rectangle, I've cut it out. So I'm using the wood side. And um, it's made to go up and down, but I'm gonna turn it sideways. And som sometimes I like it going this way, and sometimes I like it going the other way. It's my prerogative, right? <laughs> okay, and so this is just a paper from my stash. It's pretty flimsy, but um, I'm gonna put it kind of to one side and I'm just gonna, I cut it, I think it's seven inches, yeah, seven inches. And I'm gonna put it to one side with like about, I don't know, maybe a half an inch to one side. And let me see if I can tell you. Okay, it's more like five eighths to one side because I need to have room for my title to be stuck right here. Yep, and that will do it. And my goal was to title it Tutu, like the little tutu she's got on, cute. But the letters I was using, <laughs> I didn't have enough letters to write cute. So, I had to write adorable. Isn't that funny? Which is a lot more letters, but I had those. <laughs> I think that's hilarious. Okay, so let's see. Now, on this one, her tutu sticks out a little more where I have the photo. So, that is designating how I am going to lay them out because they have to overlap a little to fit on here. And I am going to be... Um, actually, I'm going to stick a little tape on them right now so that when I'm ready, they're ready. And over here, I got a, um, I think I showed you on my haul video from um, A Cherry on Top that I had bought this um, doily. Actually, it was called a mandolin, right? Mandolin? Mandala? Maybe it's a mandala. Um, but it looks like a, just a fancy doily. And I am really into doilies. And I think I've told you that before. I have them in my house. I'm not over doilied. I used to over doily. I love that too. <laughs> But I'm not over doilied at the moment. Okay, and I want that as close to the top as I can get it without it going off the edge. So maybe about there. Okay. And then I am going to use this um, window. Oh, I guess I could have looked at that to see which way it went because, ah, I just stuck it right on top of the tape. Terry, Terry, I told you I just cannot be trusted and I just tore it. Dang. 
Can I fix it? Uh, let me see. Okay, now, now you're going to see if I can fix it. Since I can't be trusted, I thought I was get, doing a good job getting ahead. Let's see if I can make it look like it never happened. Not really. But this is the only one I have unless I cut out something else. And now I've got it stuck to my table. Okay, I'm going to put a little more tape on it, I think. Or maybe I'll just skip it all together. Let's see. I'm just going to wing it and skip it all together. Because I don't have another one of those. There is one here that I could use. Let's see what I like that. Maybe. Okay, I'm going to pause and be right back. Do you notice how I always do something wrong? And then while I'm off the air, while I'm not recording, I put down the letters. <laughs> Maybe I've jinxed myself. <laughs> okay, boy, I hesitate to even put tape on this because I don't know where I'm putting it. But I'm just going <laughs> to guess. I can't get any worse, right? Okay, I still better line it up because I don't want a crooked window in my house. <laughs> okay. I still want it up kind of high. Even though this one doesn't have to be as high as the other one. Okay, and... Boy, the top doesn't look straight, but the bottom <laughs> it is hitting right up against there. Huh. Okay, let me look at it. I'll try not to put the pictures on top of each other. Okay, yeah, it looks straight now. Okay. So, now I'm back to this again. Okay, and which one has the... This one has to go on the side. Ah, let me keep putting them down on the right. I don't know what kind of a day I'm having. Okay. I will get through this. I will get through this. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put it, I think, about there. And I'm not going to put it down real hard. Okay, so I've got to slide it over. I don't want to cover up her too, 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 too much. And I want this to just be up there by that flower. And I have to leave enough room that I can get this little cup in there. This little cup, um, one time we were garage sailing and um, her mom, when she was little, I had found the cutest little musical cup. And that's what, every time I see like something in a cup, I don't know, something about it, maybe the cat in the cup or something, it just reminds me of that because um, the... The cup had a cat in it. It kind of reminded me of, um, I don't think it was Alice in Wonderland, but it reminded me of Alice in Wonderland. So every, every time I see something like this, it always makes me think of that. Okay, that's a good spot. So I'm pushing it down and I'm gonna put a little bit of dimensionals behind here, behind this little kitty. And I'm doing this so it won't take as long as when I put on all those little tiny tabs. Pull it up a little bit here. Just do bigger ones. I think this collection is so cute. And I love it that it has reds. And when I was um, 
you know, trying to find paper that had red in it. I mean, I just could not believe that my selection of red paper, excuse me, was so lacking. I mean, I would have like solids, but that was it. And I am so into using lots of pattern. I could care less if I get a solid at all. <laughs> Because I could use a pattern for everything. Okay. I'm going to stick a little piece right there to kind of hold on. Whatever I kind of cut off here, it looks like. I was got a little close. And this should help hold it there. If I can get it where I want it. There we go. Okay. I didn't even bring out my little tray that I throw all my little trash in. <laughs> oh, I think I'm using the wrong hand. <laughs> Okay, I think I'm just about got it here. So I don't know. If, oh, and um, I had got that adorable music box for my daughter. And then one day she was in the bedroom. I don't know whether she was dancing around in there or what. But um, she knocked over the bookcase that was on the top of her desk and it all came tumbling down. I mean, it's like, it, it was quite frightening because, you know, she probably came close to losing her life if that would have fell on her. Luckily she got out of the way, but that was pretty scary. Now I'm gonna put um, a little more t um, dimensional on this little kitty and um, they didn't have a cat during this time but she does have a cat now and kind of looks like this kitty I think it's like it was hiding the last time I was there so I didn't get a real good look at it Not only am I sticking things together, I appear to be all thumbs today. Ah. <laughs> and I keep using my wrong hand. <laughs> Maybe that's the hand I take tape off with. I kind of do use my hands kind of one hand I do one thing with like sports. I do everything left handed. And everything else I think I do right handed, except for maybe not pull off this tape. <laughs> okay, and I'm gonna put the little kitty down here. And I'm gonna bring him over as far as I can without him going over the edge. Because I have a little butterfly that he is going to be batting at. And it looks like his eyes looking about here. So I'm going to get it. I was kind of messing with it. It's like, okay, do I need it where his paw is or where he's looking? So I think that's where he's looking, which makes more sense to me. Okay, and now up by the tutu, I'm going to bring a flower up here and maybe even try to tuck it underneath that U just a little bit. Or 
or maybe not. Oh, yeah, I got it almost all the way moved. Okay, because I just want this tucked under here just a little. Okay, and then I'm going to put a couple of butterflies up there. And I think t um, sometimes it's like if I haven't cut through like a little bit of the decoration on the front, sometimes like when you're cutting the elements out from the mente papers, the element papers, sometimes I will find that there's little things like there, there was I think three butterflies that were so tiny, but um, I was able to cut those out and one of them is like so tiny, like a tiny fingernail, so little. But I'm going to use that one right over here by the cat, by the cat in the cup. So that's there. I was going to put the bird over here, but I don't have to now because it's already got one. <laughs> And I'm going to take a couple of these other little flowers and they might have been on the other side, but I'm not sure because they're, they're pretty small too, but it looks like they weren't. And I'm going to put one down here, kind of so the cat looks like he's almost stepping on them but not quite, because he's a careful cat. Okay, and then I was thinking about um, doing a technique on here, but um, I decided to save it for something else. So I'm kind of excited, you know, I'll probably do that next week because I've kind of already thinking about it. <laughs> okay, so I am going to Put up one of the little root I have these rubies here and I'm gonna put a little ruby remember I'm testing where I need to put them because otherwise I'm always getting them in the wrong place okay so right there should do it and I made sure I had my needle nose with me today because sometimes I can't separate them after I get them back together oh I threw it on the floor again Oh, there we go. I should have probably went back to bed this morning. <laughs> uh, tape things together. Dropping things on the floor. Didn't have the right letters. <laughs> but Okay, so I've got that there. And then I got this little periwinkle, one with dots on it that I've had like 20 years, I am going to use that today. It's my goal to use some of these things. You know, that was my, um, well, the Jen Hadfield collection, you know, it's like I had, it's like they just sat in there and every time I seen them, it's like I liked them, but I just wasn't using them. And, um, and then I've got so many other things that I just wasn't using. So it's kind of fun putting things together and it's like, I've only used two of the kits, but I already can't wait to do it again. <laughs> okay, and then over here, I'm going to put another ruby. Because I'm sure every little girl with a red tutu needs a ruby. And I'm going to use another one of the little periwinkle brads. I was so excited when I found these little tiny um, brads that were periwinkle and with white polka dots on them. And then it's like they just sat in there. It's like I don't know what I was waiting for. <laughs> I guess for this little page of Brenna's. Today's the day. 
Okay, and then up here on this corner, I am going to put the ruby over here by this bigger flower. I better measure that one and maybe put a little glue right here first because I'm going to put the ruby right in the front of it. Felt like I had a big glob of glue there. Okay. And so I'm going to put that right down here. Gosh, I washed my hands 400 times today and now I can't do a thing with them. Do you ever hear that joke before? <laughs> Am I totally dating myself? Now I've got one little periwinkle one to put over here by this little butterfly. And where do I want it? I think I'll put it about there. I can't believe how um, laying it upside down in the spot where I think it needs to be works so much better than just going over there and thinking, oh, it just needs to be at the bottom of this because um, it's like the last few that I've done that, it's like, oh, it just looks, they're actually where I wanted them. <laughs> Instead of I get them on there, it's like, oh, it's over too far. Okay. I'm loving it. And then I've got just a few brads, I mean, a few enamel dots that I would like to use on here. And so with the cup, I've got four things here. Five. Oh, I still can't pick them. I still get them caught in my nails and I just cut my nails. Six, seven, I'm gonna put on here. If I can get them out of my fingernails. <laughs> Oh, has anybody got a trick for this? Let's try this. I see some people um, work with their tweezers like it's another hand. It's really awesome. Um, I'm good with a needle nose pliers like that, but not the other. Okay, and so I've got four, five things there. So I'm just going to add two here. And I've got four things down here, so I need three. Wow, and I have one extra. I guess I can save it over here because this, I think, is the same color. Okay. Okay, so there's Brenna. And I think I do think she is too too adorable. And I will have close-ups at the end. Thanks for joining me. And if you like it, give it a like. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so. Thank you. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.